8.48 now, and a couple of the great guys from Sir Edmund Haley's are here with us this morning. Andy, hi, how are you doing this morning, guys? Doing great. Hello. You are cooking for us today, and it already smells so good, and I kind of teased everybody that this isn't your traditional meatloaf. It's not, is it? It is not. What are we making? Well, today we're making ostrich meatloaf. Ostrich meatloaf. Yeah. Is this on the menu at the restaurant? It is. It's been, uh, we're celebrating our 20-year anniversary, and it's been on the menu for 20 years. Oh, my gosh. You guys are celebrating um, 20 years. Yeah, we are. And even though, you know, we're a British uh, Celtic pub, we, uh, we have traditional fare. Yeah. You know, fish and chips, bangers and mash. We do some unique, innovative dishes, and uh, ostrich meatloaf is one of those. Yeah. What is it about ostrich that is kind of special or different? What does it taste like? I've it's, never had it's it. It's great. It's not gamey at all. It's very okay. lean, 97%. Uh, lean okay. meat, uh, so it has a great flavor. Uh, we get it locally from Oak Ridge Farms um, in Gastonia. Wow. Um, this is, they gave us one of these. Yeah, that's an eggs. ostrich egg. Yeah, ostrich I egg. I love that. They're hu they're huge and they're like they're like super solid. Okay, yeah. so what do you mix in with the ostrich okay. when it so comes time? So you have time? a you know a, a, a pound of the ostrich ground beef, but yep. we also mix in a quarter pound of. Uh, Ground beef, okay. just to add a little, a um, little fat, a little fat, a little flavor. Flavor. Um, we also have uh, some onions mm -hmm. that we put in, shredded carrots, okay, red pepper, panko, Japanese breadcrumb. Yes. Why do you like panko over just the regular average everyday breadcrumb? Uh, it it's, gives you better texture and. Okay. Uh, Going to add an egg. One regular egg, not an ostrich egg. Correct. Correct. <laughs> some ketchup. Okay. A little mustard. Yes. In there. Seems very meatloafy to me so far. <laughs> little green onion. Mm -hmm. Then we mix all that up. You put it in your loaf pan. Okay. Uh, you, you put it in your preheated oven at 350 yep. for 45 minutes. And through the magic of TV. I love the magic of TV. Does it, does it cook about... Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Oh, wow. that does pretty? it cook the same amount of time as an average meatloaf? Would yes. you do... The, okay, so it's the same kind of deal. Mm -hmm. And uh, Hiro here, tell them what you're doing with the... So we are playing the uh, meatloaf with the mashed potatoes, mm -hmm. salted julienne base. Mm. On the base, I have carrots, onions, and zucchinis. Delicious. Wow. And then we top it with our homemade uh, sausage gravy. Well, tell me about that gravy. The gravy is... Uh, everything is homemade. Like, we do the uh, beer stock at home. Really good. In the gravy is so a sausage gravy. I mean, that is a hearty meal right there, like in every possible way. What do you guys have uh, going on? In, oh, why did why did you bring this? Uh, <laughs> this is a great compliment after you've had this hearty meal. Is our Guinness chocolate pudding? That's Guinness chocolate pudding. Yes, it has a Bailey's cream on glaze. Wait a minute. Can I taste that? Absolutely. Okay. You said chocolate Starting pudding. Starting is great then. to start with dessert sometimes. Obviously. Oh, it's like a pudding. Yeah, it's really so, thick. So, talk a little bit about how this comes together. Okay, well, this uh, we developed this for uh, Mike Murphy, who was head of Guinness, <laughs> had a visit, and we wanted to do something special for him, so we created this Guinness pudding. Do people know that you have this on the menu, <laughs> and do they eat it all every day? My daughters love it, yes. That's amazing. Okay, since I had dessert first, can I taste the meatloaf since Absolutely. we're here? Absolutely. It's just having a little bit of breakfast here. <laughs> Because I've never had ostrich before, so I'm so curious about what it tastes like. Mmm. Not gamey at all, and very meatloafy. Very good. <laughs> very meatloafy. Thank you, guys. You're welcome. We'll be right back. <laughs> it's really good.